The thing that's great about this laser light system here is that, of course, we've talked about for years the fact that a shotgun pattern is not huge. For self-defense, people a lot of times think, oh, it's a big old pattern. Well, it's not. When you get close, it's a small pattern. So what you have is this approximates, approximates the size of the pattern. We've got a small circle here, just about the size of this uh, circle on the target. Let's shoot this once up close here and see what kind of pattern we get. Oh man, as you can see, that's just about, well, the size of a fist, maybe. All right, let's back up. Now, what you're going to see is the pattern of the laser gets bigger on the target. All right, see about how much bigger it is there? And this is just birdshot, okay? Let's try this and see what kind of pattern we get this distance. Let's go take a look. All right, we've got, obviously got a hole where the wad went through, but here we have the birdshot scattered all across here. So that's where the wad went, and this is the birdshot. So what this tells you is that as you back up, your pattern gets bigger. It's a great visual example. This is a great system, and it really works real well on a home defense shotgun. Aaron Moore from Laser Lights here to describe how this came about. How did you develop this? Well, it came about out of necessity. Okay. There was no way to actually present a laser downrange to show to simulate a shotgun pattern. Right. Until now, so uh, given a specialized refractive lens system, a 1.7 degree divergence of the growing dot, we created a shotgun type laser, but it could be used on any gun. Well, you could, and one of the things that I really noticed about it is how fast it is to acquire it visually. When you come up with it, instead of looking for a single dot, you see the whole circle and the dot in the mm -hmm. middle, but you can use that center dot for precise aiming, right? Exactly. So there's eight dots around it, one in the middle, you sight your shot into the first dot. That could be used on ARs, on pistols, on shotguns. It has a unique usage for shotguns, but it can be used almost anywhere. Now, what does this weigh? Now, that weighs just a few ounces. Yeah. Okay. It, it does have a lithium battery in it because okay. it is more powerful. Because you got the green, which is Cause, cause real green powerful, laser. and it's daylight visible. Yep. We will be making a red laser in the okay. same system, but as you can see, it's a smaller dot, mm -hmm. and then it grows out to a bigger dot. Which is the whole idea. As you get further back, your shotgun pattern gets bigger. Mm -hmm. And of course, also, if something is further away, you want to acquire that more quickly so you have that larger pattern, if right. you will. It's like having a reticle downrange. You're focused on the target, not on the dot. You're actually projecting a reticle, aren't you? You are. That's, you are. that's pretty sweet. I love what you're doing with this. And you've got this mount on here. How did you attach this? Well, we attached it because it's our mount. Okay. There was no better solution out there, so this system right here, the shotgun tri-rail, fits over any one-inch magazine tube, right. slides on there, which fits about anything, like, like here. Sure. And we also have an option for side-by-sides or over-under shotguns. So you have your new shotgun laser, the center mass laser system. You have a shotgun, now you can have it on there. Sweet. I like this a lot. Thank you.